Hello people, this video is a sort of a part three and follow up to the other two videos I've put up concerning the unboxing and demonstrating the Lidl's long reach hedge trimmer. There's one or two, I'll give my honest opinion, there's one or two things about it that I'd say would prevent it being sort of my favourite garden tool. One thing, the mains cable's too short, it's about two and a half metres long, about eight feet. Even though I had it plugged, I had it plugged into a long 25 metre extension reel. When you when you're moving it around the garden, that you've still got to drag the extension reel around. So that's that's a minus point. The short mains cable. Another thing, the actual machine it's well built. It's well built, does the job all right, but it's because it is well built. It's it's pretty heavy. It weighs seven kilos, or about 14 pounds. So although you've got a shoulder, like it has a shoulder strap that goes over your shoulder, that's what right you're holding it down, like sort of waist height. If, you want, if you've got like a tall hedge or bush like I was doing, you want to lift it up, hold the gadget up, no, above sort of chest height, it's pretty pretty heavy to hold up for anything. I'm fairly strong in the arms, but I have to pull it down after a couple of minutes to make my arms ache. So you, you do a couple of minutes and pull it down, do a couple of minutes and pull it down. It's a bit, it's a bit sort of, because it's obviously so long, it is a little bit unwieldy when you're, you're, when you're waving it around up in the air like doing the top of a hedge. So you think this is a bind that you've got to think, got to have fairly strong arms to use it basically so I mean it's say it's done, done the job all right but could do the longer mains cable and it's a bit on the heavy side other than that okay watch the other two videos first and then obviously this one make a bit more sense but see you on the next one people